So Amigas for Christ is a nonprofit organization. Um, it's ran by two people out of Georgia, um, a husband and a wife. They moved down to Nicaragua. They started going down really frequently. The organization does a variety of different things. They provide water systems first. Um, and you dig four foot trenches, you lay pipes, and they dig a well, and so every person has clean um, water. It's more sanitary. And then after that, they go on to um, building lifelong um, things to help communities. So um, one of the things that I've been hands on it with for the last two times I've been there is um, building a school. And the school is being built, um, and it's gonna be pre-K, uh, through high school and it'll contain um, everything that a child could ever need, um, materials, desks, chairs, things like that. Um, kids stop going to school whenever they feel like it. They don't have to go long term. Um, a lot of people don't go to college, they don't go to high school. The teachers there only have high school equivalency. So they're trying to build a school that will make the whole country want to um, start going to school and build schools. So I was actually shocked that a building that I was just there in May from May to January it could be completely built already. When I was there in May, I was there for two weeks. So the first three days we worked on the first two days we worked on the school. And so one day I did like the water system and then the second day I got to lay bricks and the cement and stuff like that. So when I walked up and I saw that that school was completely finished and we were getting ready to paint it and clean it out so that kids could start school, I was astonished that things could go up that fast and um, everything they do is by hand. So for them to mix them in and break the tiles and um, lay the tiles and all that stuff but like by hand was just, I was beyond amazed because it takes longer here, I feel like, with all the materials that we have to build a school than it does there and it was just incredible. If anyone's interested in coming, um, we are looking to set up a trip over the next winter break um, for anyone from Cabrini who wants to go. It's very comforting and welcoming and um, just a very humbling experience. If anyone wants to come, they're more than welcome to contact me and I'll give them the information.